Okay, I read the story. The victim bought clothing from the branded No One Shop in Jalan Ampang one week ago. After wearing the clothes, he washed it in the washing machine. When the clothes came out, all his clothes had lost the color and shrunk and colored other clothes. The victim is suing the shop for selling inferior stock and for ruining his wardrobe. Okay. So the first witness is the roommate. When the victim washes his clothes, he's very careful with the proper amount of bleach and, <laughs> and detergent. He always separates his colored clothes in the washing machine with the white clothes. Witness two is a customer, another customer at the branded No One shop. I've never had this problem before. I always wash my clothes properly, following the instructions on the shirt. Witness three is another customer. I have some bad experience, but didn't color other clothes as I tested it individually first. Okay, the shop owner said, we import our clothes from factories in China, but under license from reputable firm. Okay, can I, uh, the, the other, Oh, everyone now, uh, except the judge. Can I have the victim and the owner and the witnesses as well? Court arise. Hello? Ah, okay. The court is in session. Uh, we are discussing the case of the undone product today. And um, so I have my prosecutor on my right. And on my left, I have my defense attorney and the owner. Ah, yeah. Okay. So, yeah. Prosecutor, you may now present your okay. statement. Okay. First. Um, Your Honor, I'd like to question the owner. Okay. Um, right now, right, during this whole period, are you having a sale or is it a normal time? No? The, the, the claimer apologizes. Okay. Um, yes. Uh, do you have a mic? Okay. Um, Mr. Ivan, right now, right, is it a sale period or is it a normal? Uh, we just have our uh, sale period previously for the Raya break. Mm -hmm. And yeah, now it's already coming down within the wall of the sale. So, do you have like a clearance sale or? Not really a clearance sale, it's like normal uh, festival sales like that. Yeah, we have 30%, uh, 50% off for our... So all the leftover products for the, the last arrivals are just... What happens to them? Uh, we will go on with our normal sales and uh, just uh, try to sell it off. Uh. Okay. And uh, it's a mass production, right, in China? I can say it the is, because it's quite a... So how product. can you assure me that the workers are keen in looking to any defects in the clothes? Uh, for that, uh, it's actually backed up by a very, very reputable uh, firm that is going to check their qualities, I think. It's just like a Nike or either Adidas, which they have their clothes there. Okay, so how many times is it checked? I wouldn't know if that would be on the phone. So you wouldn't know how many times it's checked, so you cannot guarantee that the product is... Well, it's like serum, serum chop like that. You can just re rely on that, <laughs> whether it's uh, reputable or not. Okay, thank you, Your Honor. Okay. Um, do we have our defense? <coughs> you may question him. <laughs> <laughs> you can question anyone you like. Then can I call the witnesses? Yes. Where, where are the witnesses? <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay, uh, can I call witness number two? Okay, um, so you buy clothes for my client, right? That's right. Um, is he a honest and reti a reputable person? I don't know. I just buy clothes. I don't. I don't um, talk with the uh, people. Do you working. have any problem with the, the clothes that you buy? No, I've had no problems with the clothes I've bought. But I always wash my clothes properly. I always make sure I use the right bleach, the right detergent, and I follow the instructions on the shirt. You follow the instructions uh, that they give you on how to wash your clothes, and you have no pr problem with your clothes. That's right. See my clothes? No stain. No nothing. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, no questions. Um, okay. okay, uh, witness two, how long have you been buying from this shop? Um, I just found out about them during the Hari Raya sale. So I, my friend said, oh, there's a very good bargain there. So I went, then I bought shirts. So when you wash your clothes, right, do you, do you follow exactly? I try. You try? Quite hard, yeah. I, I would say most of the time it's pretty on target. Okay. No more questions. Okay. Um, we have our prosecutor. Would you... Any more questions? No? Okay. So our defense? Um, okay. Then I will call witness number uh, one. Okay. Witness two, you may sit. Uh, okay, so you are the victim's roommate. Yes. Okay. Um, that's uh, okay. How does uh, do you observe when your roommate washes his clothes? Yeah, all the time. Uh, so how does he wash? But then, uh, how does he wash his clothes? Very clean. Very, very systematic. Clean, very everything systematic. he follow. How? One by one, he'll put all the detergent, bleach properly. No mistake. No mistake. No mistake. Okay, uh, <laughs> uh, so he doesn't make any mistake when he's trying to wash his clothes. I don't think so because he washes my clothes also, you see? Everything okay. Right? <laughs> so your clothes have no discoloration? Uh? Not until he bought that clothes from him. Uh. Okay. <laughs> well, supposed to be white now, purple, purple stripe already now. <laughs> <laughs> laugh, like you all laugh. <laughs> okay, uh, no question. <laughs> Um, how long have you guys been staying together? About a year plus. Uh, a year plus. <laughs> a year plus. So he does all your laundry, is it? Yeah, most yeah. of them. True. Um, I mean, you can see like this clothes is actually brown by then, and the shirt is supposed to be white. But after that, right, it died. It, the I paint, thought you see it. The dye came out and then oh, bleached the shirt. Oh, okay. So your clothes is damaged because of that, lah. Yes, yeah. definitely. Okay. Strong already, you know. It's not that I fat, but strong, you know. So uh, very tight now. Okay, and uh, but you double check your clothes before you buy it, also, right? Yes, of course. Okay. No more questions. 